I'm Katie Lee and I'm going to show women's health how I keep my day on track morning, noon, and night. I'm a real creature of habit so this is pretty much how all my days go. I keep myself busy with power walks with my dog, working out online, and spending a lot of time in my kitchen coming up with recipes for both my website and my cooking show, The Kitchen, on Food Network. It's so easy to make and you get a serving of veggies. I really believe that consistency <laughs> is the key uh, for keeping on track, especially right now. I think it helps us keep our diets healthy. It just keeps your mind clear. So come along and get a peek into my day. First thing I do when I wake up, come downstairs and I press the button on the coffee maker. My husband always sets it up the night before. I get up around 6.30 and I gotta have my coffee first thing. I usually do my workout just before I have lunch. I go for a nice big power walk with my dog and then I like to do a little Obey Fitness so that I can get some toning. I do their prenatal workout, a sculpt workout. I gotta keep that in shape. <laughs> I thought I would show you how I'm making my lunch. I'm just doing a really simple protein packed pasta. So I love carbs, but when it's lunch time, you know, I try to boost up some protein, especially because I'm pregnant and I'm trying to get more of my diet. So I really like this one because the only ingredient in it is red lentil flour. And I'm gonna add to it some salt. See, this thing, it's bumping into everything. <laughs> I've got my pan over medium heat. And I'm gonna add a little bit of extra virgin olive oil. And then I like a little bit of spice. And now I'm gonna add in these tomatoes. And they'll instantly start to pop. And then I'm gonna add in my kale, right in there. And give it a little toss. Now with regular pasta, you don't wanna drain it because you want all that starch on there. But with an alternative pasta, like a lentil pasta, chickpea pasta, or rice pasta, I like to rinse it so that it's not gummy. And it's okay if the pasta still has some water on it. That'll be part of our sauce. Season this with a little salt and pepper. Toss it all together so that all of the pasta gets nice and coated. Look how bright and vibrant that is. Woo. One dropped. That'll be for the dog. Just like that. Oh, this looks so pretty. Mm, a little extra cheese on top. Look at that. How does that look? Pretty delicious, right? Getting ready for bed. I always, always wash my face. I like to use a cream cleanser or an oil-based cleanser because my skin's a little bit on the dry side. So I always start with an eye cream. I go to bed slathered with all of my creams and oils. And then I follow cream moisturizer with an oil. And I am pretty generous with the oil as well. I wear oil during the day, but I put more on at night. I do the same with cream on my neck. And then for my lips, I think it's hard to beat good old Vaseline. And I kind of just go around my lips as well. And then, with a big old belly, I slather it up with more squalene oil because I'm trying to avoid stretch marks. <laughs> Made it through another day of quarantine and I always go to bed about, about 10 o'clock, um, sometimes even 9.30. I, I like to go to bed early. And then I cuddle up in bed with this little guy and get some puppy snuggles, which I think is just wonderful for overall wellness. Thanks for following along with me today. I'm gonna turn the lights out and uh, have a good one.